Hey YouTube, it's Romeo back with a short video. Just a just a little update on the Arc Reef Purple Helix Coraline Algae in a bottle. Uh, contains live cultured algae and active nitrifying bacteria. I used a bottle of the Purple Helix and a bottle of the Pink Fusion. It's been three weeks. Um, I just turned the lights on in the tank, so the corals are kind of opening up. But like I said, it's been three weeks, and in these three weeks, uh, gotta excuse this this tank. It's been kind of neglected. I've been sick, and I'm gonna get it together. But uh, let's see. I'm looking for any coralline algae growth. It's been three weeks, and right off the bat, you see some there, some there. Um, I don't know if you can see back there, but it's some. Um, Right there, sorry for the bad focus. Um, some there, you can see splotches of it all on the rock up there. Uh, underneath this green leather, you can see the pink coralline algae drawn as well as the purple. Um, underneath these hammers that are just now opening up, you can see some there. That's growing on that epoxy. Some of the pink growing there. And underneath this one, you can just see the purple just took over on that skeleton, as well as the pink. As far as the rock that was over oh, my intake filter pipes, you can see it all growing there. Um, so, yeah, it's been about, like I say, three weeks. Oh, I gotta get this tank together. Some growing there, the purple. There's none growing up on my Duncan house. Well, Duncan pedestal. Uh, some growing down there, as you can see. So, yeah, it's been about three weeks, and uh, coralline algae is growing pretty good. Like I said, this tank started pure white rock. I mean, you still see the white rock up there where color hasn't formed and right there where you know color has well is the alkaline algae there too but yeah I use pure white marker rock except for that aquascape on that side this one was pure pure white um yeah I gotta I got oh it's all on the, the MP10 you see some on the back glass over there some on the front glass so, our grief said uh, takes about eight weeks. It's been about three weeks, and uh, yeah, it's, it's like I said, it's totally covering this skeleton. It's growing all on this epoxy. While well, I mounted my hammer corals, it's growing back there. Um, like I said, I, I'm suffering with the flu and battling cancer so this tank is a little neglected so i apologize i'm gonna get it together i'm getting here and clean the sand out and you know, scrub the rocks and beef up my uh beef up my cleanup crew and um uh, yeah so it's been three weeks and coraline now just is is crazy i'm not dosing anything i think in the last three weeks i've changed the water I did 10% water change once, and I'm using just Instant Ocean Reef Crystal, so, I mean, nothing spectacular. I'm not dosing anything. Just one water change. It's been three weeks, and that's the coralline growth so far. So, I'm going to update another three weeks. Um, this, this leather actually broke off from this one. Um... I didn't frag it. I just one day it was cutting itself apart, and this piece started off real, real small, about the size of a, about the size of a, I want to say a raisin. And I stuck a toothpick through it to mount it to that rock. As you can see, toothpick still there, and it's totally grown over the rock. Um, but yeah, it's broke off from there. Um, this one is huge. Once it opens up, right now it's a little pissed off and. It's about to shed because it's real shiny, so it's gonna shed the skin in a minute. But yeah, that's been it's been three weeks of me using 
the Arc Reefs Pink Coraline Algae in a Bottle, and the Purple Helix Coraline Algae in a Bottle. This tank started off with all white Marco Rock. Uh, no Coraline out at all. I mean, at all. <clears throat> so, gonna update in another three weeks. Oh, this, this tank looks horrible. I gotta get him clean this tank up while I feel great. So, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, any questions, comments, drop them below. Happy reefing.